put my actual tax. Here's my tax calculation right now, 14266. And now let's make the change. I'm gonna go here and let's say last time I added interest, let's add another section to my general income tab for dividends. So I'm gonna move the total down. I'm just gonna say, let's move this down. And let's say this is gonna be dividend income. And we'll make that black and white. We'll go to the home tab font group, making it black and white. I'm going to make this then blue. And so we're going to go to do making it blue and bordered. And then I'll move this down one more space here. And I'm going to say total dividend income. And let's make this pull this out. So I'm going to say this has come from E trade. And we said the total is 1000 and I'll put the qualified over here like we did with the interest. So I'm just going to put the qualified was 800 just so I can note that in my data input. So I'll just put that there and then I'll sum this up equals the sum. Du, 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 du. Actually, I need to put this in the outer column. Let's put this over here equals the sum. Du, 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 du. So I'm not including this 800 here because the 1000 includes the, the 800. And then my total income is now the 100 W2, the interest income, nothing's in it, down to the dividend income.